Morning. It's, uh, what's today? The day after the first day of the draft. It's the 25th? 26th. 26th? 26th. 26th. 26th of February. April. Good morning. It's the 26th of April, 2024. Got Paul and Taylor and myself, John. And we're out here, Saginaw Bay. Just kidding. Detroit River. Gonna do a little walleye jigging this morning. So uh, it's water temperatures reading 49 degrees, and it's great east wind at like seven miles an hour, and my boat alarms are going off. If anybody knows what the tracker boat alarms are for, please let me know. I thought I had fixed my problem. Maybe it will fix itself out here in a minute. Hopefully it will. But uh. Let you know how we do this morning and the water clarity for this upcoming weekend of the Wally opener for the rest of the state of Michigan is tomorrow. So we'll let you know how Detroit here is doing and hopefully I get this video uploaded tonight or first thing tomorrow morning. And it can help you out and get in your walleye out the field and get them in your freezer. This guy's got the net out right here, don't they? I can't see that Yeah, he does. I don't care, I don't care where we fish. Oh, it's a nice one. Yep. There's a one chasing it. You see that one oh, chasing I, it? I get in that second one, yeah. You see that one chasing it? Oh my god. Oh, it's a nice one. Yep. There's a one chasing it. You see that one oh, chasing I, it? I get in that second one, yeah. You see that one chasing it? Please. Can we come up there or off to the side? Don't matter. Is this uh, not extended? It does. He's 15, throw that bad boy in the box. Actually, I'll get him. You go fish.
one? Yeah. Alright, go fish, I got him. Honestly, I wasn't even jigging. I was texting, just holding it. Just holding it? Just holding it right on the bottom. Out of the waves. I was trying that a couple times too. Okay, so I didn't bounce on the waves. Yeah, but I wasn't having any lunch. Yep. I don't know what I was thinking, five Some explaining to do. Bring him over this way. guys that was a rough go this morning um, it's pretty windy to start off it died down a little bit the fishing was good right at you know the first half hour of daylight and then it just just shut right off um, the cow pasture and the Canadian side was real brown real muddy and then there was some good stained water and we picked up another fish or two in there and lost a couple. But it was a real slow bite. The temperature, water temperature was um, high 40s. I've got some people telling me like, oh, it's over, the run's over. And it's time to start dragging crawler harnesses. But I'm telling you, I'm telling you, we've got two and a half more weeks. It's just this cold, push and the temperature dropped my opinion i think the fish are just a little tight-lipped right now but um i think next week with the warm-up towards the tail end of next week it's gonna be back on fire so if you get out in the next week look for that good colored water um and, and go get some fish today's colors really weren't i mean we caught them on everything I think Taylor had the most hits though, and he was using like a, it was like a log perch type of color, um, white on the bottom, brownish green on top, and yeah, that's what it was. And that's probably what we had the best success with. Um, having issues with my Mercury motor, 
it uh it was giving me some beeps so i was gonna get it in i tried changing the oil um dumped the old oil out put new oil in filled it up to the top thought maybe that was it it did it again today and then at the end of the trip it gave me a long steady single beep and then it killed the throttle on my motor it just rpms right down and i had to just idle in real slow so i don't know i'm gonna have to get it in if any of you guys are out there tracker mercury guys you've had this issue before please leave me a comment down below um if you're gonna get out this weekend be safe weather's supposed to be nasty and raining it's cold out the fish have been tight lipped last couple days um if you can wait till next week after the couple days of the warm-up the water temp comes up i'm willing to bet the fish will turn on with a bite again so good luck to you if you can get out and uh get some walleye out of the field get them in the freezer